Hey boys, so this week we are learning about the plant life cycle, so I thought it'd be a little fun if we did an experiment. So today we are going to be doing a celery stalk experiment where we put it in water and see what happens to the water and to the celery. Um, in your learning menu, you each have a form. I want you to make sure that you have this form with you during the video so that you can be filling it out. If you don't have it, go get it and then come back. So the question that we'll be asking in this experiment is what will happen to the celery stalk when it is placed in a glass of colored water? So what we'll be doing for this experiment is we'll be filling up this mason jar with one cup of water, which I have right here. I already have it measured out. I will be putting blue food coloring into the water so that we can see it just a little bit better. And then I will be putting the celery stalk in here. After one hour, I will come back and we will see what happens. And then again, tomorrow, 24 hours from now, I will take another video so that you guys can see what happens to our celery and the water. And that's why you need this sheet so that you can see, or so that you can fill out what is going on during the experiment. But first, before we do anything, I want you to fill out your prediction. What do you think will happen to the celery? All right, now that you have your prediction, we can start our experiment. So the first step that we need to do, just to make sure that this works well, is we need to cut off this bottom part of our celery. It's so big and clumpy and you can see how large it is. So we're just going to cut this off so that the water can um, absorb into the celery. All right, so here's my bottom, and then here's the celery that we're going to be using. Now this celery that I picked does have leaves so that it is a little bit easier to see what happens. Now, we are going to pour, well, yeah, we're going to pour one cup of water into our mason jar. Now remember, I've already measured this out, so I know it's exactly one cup. All right, now I'm going to take our food coloring and put in 10 drops. I'm just going to do 10 drops just to start. Okay. Oh, I almost got 11. I'm just going to mix it together. I should have got a spoon. That's all right. Clean that. And this is what our water looks like. So it's a super dark, dark blue color. I think it's very pretty but you guys know I love blue, so. Now, we're going to take our celery and put it in the water. I dropped a little bit, it's all right. Got little baby ones here. Okay, so I want you on your form that you have here to draw what is happening to our celery. What does it look like right now? If you have colors, that would be awesome so that, that we can show what's going on throughout the day. So, this is what it looks like. A little bit closer up here. I have a little hill guard down there. So I want you guys to draw. Make sure you get the watercolor and the, the green celery. Now in one hour, we're going to come back and take a look at it. In your video, I'm just going to skip forward. But in real life, it's going to be one hour. All right, boys. Make sure you draw your picture and let's see what happens in an hour. All right guys, so it has been exactly one hour and already things are starting to happen and it's pretty cool. Now it is a little bit difficult to see in the video so I'm going to take some pictures so that you guys can see it a little bit better and those are going to play right after this. Do you see those blue streaks? 
That is actually the water starting to absorb up into the celery. How cool is that? Now in this picture, you can start to see that the water is going up into the leaves. That's what that blotchy blue is. It's actually the water going into the leaf. It's pretty cool too. I want you to use this picture to now draw your observation for what the celery looks like after one hour. Then we are going to see what it looks like after one whole day. All right, boys, it has been exactly one day, 24 hours, since we put the celery in and it is looking so cool. I love it, it's so pretty. So I am going to show you guys just a little bit closer up so you can see all the detail in the leaves from what the water did to the celery. All right, as you can see down here towards the base of the celery, it's super, super dark because that's where the celery is absorbing the water. Once we come up here and take a look at our leaves, you can see how cool they look. I think they turned out so, so cool and I love the color. Now this is how plants absorb water and nutrients from the soil. The reason our leaves turned blue is because we use blue water. Now if we had just used regular water, our celery would not have turned out like this. So, so cool looking.